Hello everybody, Ian Robson. Welcome back to Railway Empire. All right, so we have moved on to the next campaign here. Uh, so we have to do, we're, there's civil war in the United States right now, apparently. And we need to, I've done all these ones already. And we need to deliver weapons to Knoxville and Jackson. So that's where we kind of are right now. Uh, keeps growing, good. So I have a train coming in. That's the one that just came in there. So I guess we made, we uh, took a couple loads there, six loads. So we're so gonna get some weapons to Jackson as well. So I believe we have some trains that go to Jackson. As you can see, I have a couple trains going to Knoxville. Apparently not everyone has weapons, unfortunately. And then I think I have a couple to go to Jackson as well. Oh, where are we? Probably down here. So what I did is I set it up so I had a couple trains going all to the same place. Uh, look at all this. Bandits have taken over the train in Columbia, Memphis, and robbed the passengers. Do you want to pay compensation to the victims, the travelers? And, and sure, why not? What's the what's the hold up here? Holy cow! Look at all these trains just holding here for some reason. Oh, it must be this one they're waiting for. There we go. So one of the things I know, kind of noticed is um, if you don't uh, kind of set up your set up your main hubs in a specific way, it can get really hairy sometimes. Like right now, I don't know if you can see this or not, but we have a number of trains just trying to get to Louisville at the moment, and they're all just waiting because like you know one train will go there, and they have to wait for the next train. So here's the next train just sitting here. And this is going to come back here. It's not too bad. I think I might build. There's a signal right there, so. It's not that far away, really. What's this guy waiting for? There's nothing there. Oh. Let's see if I can pick a. He's going to Columbia to Franklin Pit. So he's just bypassing this all together. Jeez Louise. I don't know why, why. Why is he just sitting there, though? Still. He should be able to just bypass this all together, like. I don't know. Sometimes it doesn't make sense. Uh, I guess we could do that. That's the Parker Ranch, though. It doesn't really help. Because we need to go this way up here the warehouse yeah it's kind of funny how you set it up sometimes so I guess I can just do this and have it fall along here but the thing is we need to go in oh no that's fine actually oops so then if they want to go either way I suppose they can now but it's weird, it's kind of funny the way they have it set up sometimes, it doesn't always make sense to me. So one thing I kind of realized is like all this traffic going down here, I almost feel like I should have made a dedicated line. Because right now the jam up seems to be Louisville. And when trains are trying to go through seems Louisville, like your engineer has been caught with their pants down. They, it seems like they continuously get just hold, held up here. So like this guy right here is just chilling out there. I guess he wants to go through on one of the line one, line two, or something like that. So I don't know. The silly thing is, he can definitely. Oh, maybe if he goes on the outside. Maybe it's because he just can't go the other way around. I don't know. Let's see if we can connect these up here. Just for the sake of. Let's see. Can we get that to connect? Oh, we actually can. And then that's uh, there. Can we get those one? Probably not there, but maybe back further here. I'm just trying to make it so the train will decide to go through there. Oh, there, there it goes. No, it's like needs to go on the second route. Or the second little train path right here. So maybe there should be a a bypass altogether going around the city, which 
which may not be a terrible idea at this point. For those trains that don't need to go to the city, I don't know. It's funny the way it's set up sometimes. Okay, so these trains are moving again. Slowly but surely. What's this guy going to? Waiting for Indianapolis to Louisville. Hmm. Can you do? Oh no, it's kind of it's weird because the way it's set up. Because like, the plane of the direction they're heading off. Like, if I go up to Indianapolis, it can't go on the four and like track four here. It has to be like track one. Almost like track one, basically. So. I don't know. Because it's time sensitive, it's almost like I should kind of just leave it for the time being. Uh, let's see here. Where are you going? Louisville to Columbia. So they're all doing the same thing here. What's this guy doing? Jacksonville Farm to Columbia. Franklin Pitt. So some of the ones that could go around, maybe I could make it so it does that. I don't know. Okay, so leave that for the time being. These guys are just chilling out here. What's the hold up over here? This is what happens when you get too many trains early. You should be able to go. There's nothing really stopping you from going right here. Waiting for the warehouse, Louisville 2. Oh, it's that guy right there. Why are you waiting for that guy? Maybe I'll just put the signal up here somewhere. Behind this train. And then delete this one. So that we don't have trains just sitting there. There we go. Guys, I guess what was happening is just like the train was holding up like just too close to the switch right here. And that was making it a problem, I guess. So the problem that I have run into up of course here as well is that all my production of uh, Seems like your engineer has been caught with their pants down. All the production of my weapons is right here. I'm waiting for iron. And we haven't produced do we have enough weapons here? Where's the stock? How much is available? So I just need iron. Which is supposed to be coming from Nice. Uh, it's supposed to be coming from the warehouse over here, which should have iron in it. Or no, where's the other one? Here's the Franklin pit. So these guys are just going straight from here all the way across to here. So like that's kind of, because I have to go through all this traffic, that's what's causing the issue. You know what, we have $500,000. Let's try and fix this issue a little bit here. So let's go. Uh, let's break off here. Okay, that's good. And, okay, I guess that could work too. That's a lot cheaper than doing... Okay, it's a 1%. One percent. It's not too bad. Because the whole point of this whole like uh, uh, the whole point of this, I don't know, scenario is to try and save, you know, fix the war, like kind of like you know, help deal with the war sort of thing. So, uh, let's see here. Don't have a, quite enough money for that. That's funny. Okay, so we'll stop there for the time being then. Where does it give me red? It looks like it's green everywhere. Oh, right here. So what we're going to do is just connect this up to Columbia so there's more of a direct route. So. 
that we can hopefully finish this uh, this scenario. Hopefully being the keyword here, of course. Um, I don't know if we can connect this up to down here actually wouldn't be terrible. Uh, yeah. Let's see. Can we... Mm. That's not that's gonna be too close. So maybe if we did it like this and brought it from here, which is kind of just the exit of the uh super expensive. <laughs> Can we build a bridge instead? What about there? There, that's not so bad. Hold off a second there. There we go. <laughs> All right. I have to wait a little bit while now here, I think. I'm getting some more cash because I just spent a crazy amount of cash just connecting those two slides over there. So I don't know, we'll see what happens. So we'll probably be able to, let's see if it goes this way. Because they're going down to Memphis, not the Jackson Pit, so. I don't know how I have it set up, so like that might've been just a waste of money for all I know too. Yeah, it might have been actually, now I'm thinking about it. Louisville, Columbia, St. Louis. That, no, that's sugar. Sugar, coal. Nope. All the ones we want are all. Oh, breakdown, okay, whatever. Ones, all the ones we want have to go down in here, basically. All of them do. I'm going to do that by <laughs> the end of this year, basically. So I have seven and two, so it's not too bad to Jackson. Or too bad to Knoxville, I should say. But to Jackson, only two. Should have been a more direct route, I think. And that might have made my, my situation a little bit better here. Okay. So there's guns going to Jackson. Okay, good. Nope. Seems like your engineer has been caught with their pants down. Okay, so we've got some more coal going there. Probably should have put that into a warehouse. If I had planned this out a bit better. Why is that red? Oh, is that that's the competition or is that just the one I made? Yeah, that's the one I just made, I think. Could be an express line now. we got here Knoxville yeah I don't know we're gonna see what happens here I'm not sure so he's going to Memphis but he's waiting on trains to go down here oh really I don't we don't have a lot of money to deal with this but we'll, we'll give it a go at the very least here so This journey into the unknown. You're too kind. Okay, so yeah, at least these trains need to get a move on here. I feel like I should move this. Move it up a little bit more, I think, maybe. 
let's see, I know you can put a, a signal. So I'm just going to delete this right here. Because <clears throat> what's happening is they're stopping right there at that light, at that light. And it's stopping these trains from going around here. Okay, and you're gonna wait right there at that light, eh? Uh, That's probably gonna be too close. Why did I put a light right there? Like seriously. That should be the last one up there because you wanna leave the section open so trains from here can go up there, but hey. And they're all waiting for, uh, let's delete that one real quick here. Once those trains start moving forward. Because they should do. There we go, there's that one moving. And that one moving. And... Let's get rid of there. Now we shouldn't have any train stopping right in front of that anymore. Okay, June. We have a few more months to go. Okay, it's going to Jackson. Good. We need some of that money going to Jackson. Uh, reduce the train. We don't need train cost. Mixed freight. What are we? What are we using right now, anyways? I think it's one of these ones. 60, 65. I guess we could replace that with the Tyson 10 wheelers. What weighs 50 tons and has no wheels. Do you think the thing is good enough? Random breakdown. Worst place to have a breakdown in the tunnel. Goodness gracious. All right, so let's take a look at our train here. It's pink. And let's... Let's see all the freight trains, mixed trains. That's not a great express train one. All. We don't have the money to replace them all. Are you moving yet? There we go. So I was working on this last time. The idea would be was to have them come in here to the warehouse and drop the the am ammunitions off there or guns off there and then have them go from there but I ran into a bit of an issue so trying to get the like the track to go from like here over to here because there's an incline just wasn't happening so I'm not sure I don't know sure if there's a better way to do it so I could maybe zoom around there and around the back I don't know it looks like I could probably No, see even there. So I could like peel off of this and then go over to there, something like that. That's not a terrible idea, I suppose. A lot of extra money though. All right, so he's going out to Jackson. So let's see, what do we got? So Jackson should be getting close to being done then. Hopefully, getting the guns there near Nashville. No, not right now. So here's another train coming down here. It's going to Knoxville. It's supposed to be taking guns to Knoxville. I guess they just don't have enough. Uh... No, they got stuff. They're making stuff. How much do we have sitting here at this actual uh, location itself? Uh, in stock, I guess, is the word I'm looking for. In one. Okay, that's not bad. Okay. Just to make sure we get all that uh, iron ore over here, basically, is the big key. Yeah, things seem to be moving a bit better, but Knoxville still, or Louisville, Louisville still the Still the central hub that's making everything's making everything a little difficult. 
just because think of the way it's set up. Unrest in New York. Populist does not want to want to go to war. Does not want to go to war. Well, that makes sense. So, anyways, folks, I think we'll end up there for now. Um, didn't, I'm not sure we're going to quite finish this. We'll see what happens here in a second here. Anyways, my name's Ian Robson. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, why don't you go ahead and hit that subscribe button for some more Railway Empire. Catch you guys later.